for those who have actually missed it, I have two parts first to the spy through. Where I talked about numerous things. The primary part was that Traitor Assassin is not a bad concept. The issue is that Rogue pulls it off in a very upsetting way, to say the least. Oh, and uh, this will probably come out later, but Shay ultimately turns to a hypocrite, which is honestly a massive spelling of Rogue that I don't think a lot of people do race as a pointer. Because again, and it will be seen later, they quit the Brotherhood because of mass civilian casualties. Shay, Colonel Monroe told us what happened. You, sir, are a fool. But thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Master Cormac, I am sorry to bother you when you were barely out of your sick bed. No, I, I've had enough of being cooped up. Then perhaps you could get a friend of mine out of trouble. He discovered a nest of criminals developing strange weapons. Look at these. Bullets as loud and bright as firecrackers. If we might have a moment alone. His name is Christopher Gist. And he might be in over his head. I fear these brutes will hang him like a dog. I will not let those outlaws have another victim. Good. The villains are entrenched at Old Fort Arsenal. I have urgent business in Albany. Please, tell Master Gist to join me there. You hear, dearie? They are hanging a man in the old fort. Oh, it would be a shame to miss that. <laughs> Christopher Guest, I'm Shay Cormac. Charles! Uh, what are you doing here? Don't mind me asking. The colonel sent me. Uh -huh. I honestly feel like Shay shouldn't have these hidden blades yet until he meets paper. This is actually a problem I've had with later Assassin's Creed Shay. games. Ran them right out of their own den. Well, I was looking for a new place to live. Well, don't put your name on the door yet. There may be a few men left on their ship. Look, the bird is nested right over there. It's a bargain. What is she doing there? That's my ship, friend. Begging your pardon, but I must go fetch her back from those louts. Oh, wait! I can hardly let you do that alone. Pardon me if you can, then. How convenient that it's the morgue that he finds. Criminals are everywhere, and most of them look just like law by And they've been harassing the people who've nursed me back to health. Sounds like good folks. They are. Perhaps you know them. Barry and Cassidy Finnegan. I've never met them, but I knew their son. Careful now. These ruffians can be anywhere. You can draw them out by making noise. Oh, I've got something better than that. Well, you seem to be more than capable of taking care of this matter. <clears throat> I tell you what, I shall find a new crew for your vessel, in case you have to leave post haste. Funny enough, this is actually the multiplayer 
how the multiplayer does these type of things. <laughs> so what happens is like multiplayer actually has a system to find targets. So this circle is actually used in order to detect where your enemies are. But to be exact, where your enemy and your target is. And it's a really nice way to use a system that's not going to be used anymore. I need to shoot them. Oh, and again. But I can't kill them. That sucks. I'll just give her some sleepy pills while I'm here. Night night, buddy. There's one here, so not here. I don't have to deal with that anymore. Oh, look at that. Wow, what a wimp. He dies from a fall like that. It's your ate that shit like champ. Probably up there. Oh, there she is. There we go. Now she got the sleepy pills ready. I'll be clear here, I don't dislike Rogue's gameplay. It's actually pretty fun. Though honestly, it's really hard to mess up considering it's actually using the gameplay systems of pretty good Assassin's Creed games. Then I actually like that they're reusing the multiplayer system, even though it's never gonna be used ever again. And I'll be honest, the multiplayer for Assassin's Creed was really fun. And they stopped using it. How convenient is the Morrigan? Did they have fucking you refurbish the ship or something ship. else? And true to my word, I found a crew for her. I did leave one position unfilled, though. Tell me, Shay, do you have a first mate? Used to. He's 
Long gone. Then I apply for the post, Captain. I love it to sell us, buddy. I'll come aboard. As your first mate, may I suggest our next destination? The Colonel will be expecting me to report back. My thoughts exactly. Colonel Monroe said he'd be in Albany. Splendid! Here we go. Right, the colonel waits on Albany. I wonder what he has in mind for us to do next. Us? I thought you just wanted to check in with Monroe. Not sign me up for the Very army. Straight to land, Captain. Not at all, sir. But I admire the colonel's idea. Ah, huh, that's actually how I meant something. I actually got the name wrong. For some reason, I thought the Morgan was the Morgan. <laughs> Let's think of the Trader Witch instead of what the actual Morgan is. This is a pretty nice day. Want to help make it happen? Colonel Monroe is an intriguing man, and he certainly seems honorable. We'll head for Albany. After that, I'll see. And we're in Albany. Mm. <laughs> if they're warning me to upgrade my ship now, that means it's, uh, I gotta get fucked if I go for it. Service can I provide? Yeah, let's have a look around. My thanks to your trust, Captain. All right. Then there's like a few random ships. Where the hell? No, oh, there it is. Oh, that's just uh, kind of awkward.
Figure out to get back to ship. Oh fuck! I hope I don't have to actually swim my way there. Well, oh hey, I don't have to. Good. Give me some speed. Blue sail. Well, you know, I don't know. There we go. Okay, so it wasn't actually uh, off base, but actually comparing Morgan to Morgan. <laughs> I actually just looking at the wiki while I'm actually here. Did figure out why I actually got the idea of Morgan and Morgan connected, and it's like, yeah, it turns out they were actually trying to make a connection between both of them. It's actually really awkward. I love these chances, man. Probably the best part of uh, uh, SN's Creed 4. I actually like the story of SN's Creed 4, but man, the shanties were probably the one thing that kept me going throughout the series. Ah, fuck, I... Uh, I'll fight it. Awesome. Blew up, blew up. Get the base, <clears throat> into the wind. Four cups, blue. Three. Three. Oh, so the more cups, blue. Three. 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 Because this thing is actually almost a semi-automatic. Yeah, limited ammo. It really doesn't matter if you actually one-shot all of them like this. 
and a ship takedown without even having to actually touch the opponent's ship. Uh. No repair at shore. I have to repair it now. <laughs> I love how fast you need to praise them. I know that these guys don't get paid much, which is why they're actually happy to get a new flag. They're under new flags, but man. But then again, if you're a traitor, everyone's a traitor now. I'm fine with that. Done. God, Rooks gives you way too much OP shit to start with. It is dumb. I oh, don't I don't need more crew members. We should reinforce the Morrigan with these supply sheds. That's the plan. Oh shit, Bonnie Hunter. What's their stats? If those are some good stats, I'll kill them. Got some good stats, man. Oh, hit the brig. Yeah, I can deal with it. I may have actually chewed uh, a bit more than I could chew at this one. Alright, time to take that brig. By like shooting it ten times. One, two. There we go. <laughs> and I didn't even have to step on the ship once. As if we at least had you step on a ship. <laughs> Intentional side effect of people who know how to play through naval missions playing through this game again, or just Ubisoft not realizing that this is extremely abusable. Then again, combat is stupidly easy, so I wouldn't even be surprised it was on purpose. 
It saves so much time compared to waiting just for it. Time. Yep. Adios. See ya. Ciao. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I just send him to Cormex Fleet again. Honestly, I personally feel like uh, Shay should have gotten a ship this like, a lot later. It is. It makes sense they get the naval missions earlier because what a sense before started with naval missions basically. I just feel like in terms of storytelling, it'd be much better to actually give you the ship a lot later. I can barely see what they are. Alright, there we go. And that's the last one. There we go. We're closer. Doesn't mean I won't stop using these guns. One. There's a battle there. Somehow missed those barrels so many times. It is. <laughs> Welcome to the traitor's party, buddy. I know you were trained on these guys for years. You may have actually became family, but uh, now you're new family. Oops. Wrong side of the cliff. Travel speed. Alright. Let's turn. Slow down. Back to travel speed. Oh, 
50 yards off the win. I like boats. What's on your mind, Captain? Ah, uh, I go up to the broads I can, so the heavy shots. <laughs> no, the puck was great. I upgrade whole armor. And a heavy shot. There was a sus for a jackdaws. It feels a little bit overdone, actually making the water shine like that. And that looks like a bug. In good health, I see. Yeah, thanks for the captain here. He's a fine vessel, Captain Coleman. Thank you, Colonel Monroe. Master Gist, did you learn more about our conspirators and their new weapons? Well, only that their base of operations is a French fort further downriver. It's a little close for comfort, isn't it? If the French have installed a fort in our territory, they are likely preparing an assault. New York could burn. Will you join us, Master Cormac? <laughs> Nothing better to do, sure. Aye. Enough innocents have died already. Uh, might I suggest we improve our vessel? The Morrigan is good. But with a few more supplies, she could be unstoppable. And you know, there's a French outpost nearby, I happen to know. I like the sound of that. Oh, whoops. Hey, Tansi. Not here. What sort of business are the French up to there? Just occupying the territory? It is an economic incursion more than a geographical one. Some of the ruffians are sponsored by enemies of the colonies. They intend to undermine local authorities. I've heard they steal from civilians and resell essential goods for ten times the price. It's always the little brother who gets skinned. Fire! You and Gist here seem inspired. There's something in the water, or in the whiskey. Now, why do you say that, Mr. Cormac? I think Shay here is skeptical about our intentions towards our fellow man. I understand that there is no need. For the I simply want these colonies to be a place of safety, development, and purpose. Funny. I thought rich men wanted them to be a place of profit. I am not a rich man, Master Cormac. Money is a means to an end. Not an end in and of itself. Uh, take it over. <laughs> you get the rope dart? 
What the hell was that? Yeah, I honestly actually missed the Sense Creed 2's parkour. It definitely was faster than this. It also was prone to getting you thrown off buildings by accident, but that was actually the fun of it. It's just too safe. Not enough risk, and also not fast enough. It's also boring. Way too boring. I can understand why it is because of trees, but you're not gonna be using the high level free running technique when you're doing that. First deal. Donc je me suis enrôlé pour une autre année. Vraiment. Attends. C'était quoi ça Arrêtez ce bâtard Je peux la balade ici Non, et la violette Hop, oh, whatever. Yeah, I have no idea what happened. Oh, what's up with our house? I think it's this one. Yeah, it's this one. Tobacco. That guy's boring. Now let's use those materials to give the Morrigan more firepower. We will need more powerful guns before we approach that fort. Go to your cabin to arrange the work. Now we can upgrade from here. That's neat. <laughs> what do you mean could you? Yeah, I don't... Morgan upgrades. Now we're gonna talk about the ram. Is it mortars? Mm. 
Yeah, I remember correctly. Actually, if I believe correctly, you would probably be doing the same way you would do a sense before sport takeover. <laughs> Me, I'm just going to be retreading to the grass again. Splendid! That fort and the defenders will tremble before the Morrigan. Get the main Your ship is in fine form, Master Cormac. That fort should offer little resistance. I rather hope the frogs offer some, else this will be a dull day. Never wish for battle, Master Giss. There is plenty around here for any of our lifetimes. Besides, if we find the fort's commander, the French will surrender, no? Indeed, that is a sensible strategy. But we will have to wear down the fort's defenses first. There's our target, Shay! Knock us down like a game of ninepins! Begin by hitting her towers. What the hell is going on? Actually, getting away. What the fuck? Oh, yeah. I'm using that for a cheese. Yep, cheese is still available. You should have to skip these animations if you actually seen them. It's not the worst, but God. No it can get very grating when you actually have to do these animations. my shot. Five. Yep. Alright, I'd like to shoot the gun. Where can't shoot him? There we go. Probably our rope blocks bullets. Though, so, well, this were pretty shitty back then, so I wouldn't actually be surprised that's actually possible. Uh, I'll salvage it. <laughs> I don't need to repair it since I already took down the force gun. Actually, did I? Actually, wait, I didn't take the force gun. Whatever, three bars is more than enough to actually take the, sh uh, take the fort down. They're too close, sir. Right. Base out. Let's go. Guns down. Now you just board in, uh, hit them, and you basically win. Wait, get 
My bad. Why? No, not that much. Let's see what. Hey, buddy. See ya, buddy. Oh no, he sees me. Oh, he lived? Chasseur. Say, <coughs> it has been so long. Were you on a special mission? Yes, from Achilles. How interesting. So am I. Don't make me do this, Le Chasseur. Who would assassinate me? I thought that was your special time. We could both just leave. Ah, but then I would tell your brothers that you are alive. You have to kill me. I feel that's pretty pointless considering that he hasn't actually done anything bad. And he could straight up just talk them out of it. Don't get your hopes up. I'll keep up with you. You are always good at your business, Shay. As were you. Tell me, what are you doing in land? Special weapons. Poisonous gases to use against colonial authorities. I am merely a delivery man. Then may your final delivery be swift. So basically, the colonials were fine with gassing innocent people. Which again, if they actually went to this angle instead of just pulling some bullshit about the artifacts, it would have worked a lot better. Because the inciting incident would not exist. The inciting incident would have actually been something they personally would be against instead of just being an outright honest accident that no one felt like talking out of. Now to actually get these forts open. Le Chasseur was right. I... I had no other choice. If the assassins find out I'm alive, they'll come after me. I feel like that's not actually the case yet. The only thing Shay did was steal a book, and they were trying to reason them out, and then they shot him. It feels like they could have really talked things out. But someone just decided to throw this conflict from a 5 to a 100. This is generally just terrible writing. And one thing I'll actually say. You were busy down that something port, that's justified is not actually good. You don't say. What do you find? This thing. <laughs> uh, in, in any case, amongst other things, I found maps and charts detailing various French trade routes. What are you thinking, guest? I thought perhaps we could use them to um, help the Royal Navy and fill our pockets. I stored these maps in your cabin, Captain. Should you wish to use them?
This is gonna take a while. Hey, Louisiana. No, I'll take that one. Okay. So this is basically what? Time reward? Let's see what's... Ha! <laughs> yeah, floor is still risky. Guess nothing's changed. Nothing, never changed. I don't stay, I'm actually surprised you could redecorate the room so fast before you actually officially joins the Templar brother. Ah. Captain Hale, Hale, they're not called Brotherhood. Yeah. He has returned to New York. But you look troubled. Do, do you ever wonder if you're doing the right thing yet? If you chose the right path? <coughs> I used to, my young friend, but not anymore. Not since I met the Colonel. And what's the question? The French are entrenched in our territory. It's about time we root them out. Of course. You're right, Kiss. Let's head back to New York. Hi, Captain. Come along, come along, you jolly brave boys. <laughs> plenty more grog in the jar. We'll plow the briny ocean like a jolly rolling star. This actually also pertains to another issue, which will let come way farther down the line. Not now though. I haven't gotten there yet. But you'll eventually get there. Yeah, I can use fast travel. Loose and catch the wind. All right, one A. Turn around and that's good to go. Loose and I would never get used to this type of parkour system. I feel like just led, uh, jumping up and ground the ledge, spamming that repeatedly, or just doing a hook and run feels uh, more intuitive to the player, and just holding shift and do the par let it parkour through the rest. You already have this system, but at the very least you can actually change directions very quickly. Yeah, they actually look cool when they were doing it. But I don't know if you technically do have control, but it feels way too artificial. Why the hell is there in a random spot on the ground? A good catch. 
Yeah, not like it matters much. Oh, uh, just because I like to spoil things, uh, and canonically, if the lot while I was in character, he would straight up have actually helped Jay, because part of his character is that if he feels that a cause is not noble, he will work against it. It is why he left, uh, not Hapum. It is why he ultimately left Hapum to join the assassin because he felt that the assassin were a much nobler cause. So if the assassin were doing shit like bombarding or gassing random citizens for no reason, he would outright actually work against them. He would still be an assassin, mind you. Assassins can actually have conflict in ideologies, but he would definitely not work alongside them. Somewhere, what the fuck? How am I missing? Is that around here? Ah! Uh, give me a second. Alright, where was I? Oh, yeah. I did all of that actually not help the assassins at all. Stop. Or at least not the Colina Assassin if he felt that the cost did not fit his idea of what was noble. Oh, and he'd actually also check up in Hayfall. Thanks a lot, game. Ah, Master Colmack. What you have learned from Le Chasseur was confirmed. The local lawbreakers are changing tactics. What's their plan now? Their boss yes, the entire Benjamin city. Franklin to produce new weapons for them. He's very well guarded. Benjamin Franklin. The scientist? You have heard of him. Good. He is making equipment to spread gases among the populace. Toxic ones, as it turns out. Keep in mind, this is not something that the assassins would do, because the second tenant outright forbids them from doing shit like this. This feels more like an infected assassin, uh, Kree, a brotherhood, over an actual assassin's brotherhood. This would be a lot more likely to happen if shit like the precursors just took them over. So the assassins do this type of thing directly just contradicts their uh, contradicts their fundamental beliefs. So it doesn't make any sense that they would straight up gas an entire city full of innocents. At Templar's house, I can get. This is this is like gassing this president's house. It's not exactly a good act, but it's not fucking half an entire city just to get one guy. Also, I still believe that she shouldn't have the hidden plates yet. At least not two. 
Like this time for Go Ahead and Blaze is still wrong. Uh, it is good to see you again. Your friend Hope said you were away. I, I, I was. Uh, sir, I, I've come to collect the results of your experiments. Oh, well, it's a very good thing then. I just finished fixing the prototype. Here you go. A gas gun? I was preparing to leave for Philadelphia and then Europe. I was invited to lecture in London. Oh, good for you. Would you be so kind as to inform Mistress Hope? Of course. It just feels so out of left field. Uh, because the assassin's basically just did an R180. The city against itself. What have you become? Something the matter, Master Cormac? Uh, no, no. Yes, just old memories. Keep in mind, we don't really have any reason to believe the assassin we just turn left field like that. So this is basically just antagonizing them for the sake of making it so the players don't feel anything betraying them. A good betrayal story doesn't have you betray the antagonist because they're evil. A good betrayal story should actually have that little end. Where you just question whether it's right or not to betray them. This prototype seems very powerful. It is. Use it with It's care. basically a grenade. <laughs> it's Our intelligence very says this all things thing considered, since grenades, I don't think it exists that way. As well as injure several enemies at once. Yeah, it's a grenade. There is also a more subtle way to use it. Some of these grenades contain a strong sedative. Fire one into the crowd, and they will fall asleep immediately. We should test this new weapon. Use it against that door. Yeah, I don't think grenades were actually a thing back then either, so it would be a Use lot these grenades to destroy that door. Just grab my grenade. Yeah. Good work. Good work. Keep in mind, Connor doesn't get this shit either. He only gets a smoke on a few guns. There is so shaking such advanced weaponry so suddenly feels right now, so weird when you take in context. This shit still. never comes up I mean, in Assassin's Creed Three. That's my first target. Be careful, Master Cormac. We understand that the ingredients are highly unstable. All the better. Yeah, I just throw a shot at it. It's a lot faster that way. Oh, whoops, that's the wrong one. There we go. Alright, let's see if a grenade I can use. That'd be pretty nice. Oh no, I guess I'll just go for the ammo box. Alright. Good is dead. See ya. It's just a matter of time before we catch you. Got him sighted. Make a good line on him. Dream on, maggot. You won't escape us. Not 
I really hope there were no civilians there and they all managed to actually get me. I don't know why the basement looks a little bit weird blowing up an entire block. <laughs> this is just an actual small problem and honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if we actually got them to evacuate fast enough. That is probably his full gang. What marvelous destruction, Captain. I saw the smoke all the way from the morning. Yeah, it's not a good thing. Discourage those miscreants. New York is safe for now. But with all due respect, Colonel, it's going to take more than a few explosions to get rid of this car. We had to The boy is right, Colonel Monroe. Shay, was it? Congratulations. He just burned the whole lot of rats out of New York. I'm Jack Weeks. This is William Johnson. I don't know about him, but I'm pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. It is uh, terribly dusty here. I'm sure Shay can recount his adventures to us over a pint. Hey, the first round's on uh, the Colonel. Huh? <laughs> Something the matter, Master Cormac. Just a little confused. I uh, must have breathed some of that gas. Some ale will do you good. Come, we are all friends here, and we'll be taken care of. We'll say I am actually fine with the gas being a thing because uh, these type of things are possible even during the past era. I am not actually fine with them basically having a pocket grenade launcher. It may seem weird, but it's just odd that Connor doesn't even get something similar like this. Now, I get he's an assassin, but fucking hope was getting a grenade launcher as an assassin. So it's kind of weird Connor didn't meet up with like a Templar grenade launcher. Oh, and it is actually a good time to tap off because now it's a new sequence. What's the part that? Oh hey, a Skyrim book. And I'm like, I really feel like in the first section, the mortgage Dear could Master be Cormac, brandished with method. Actually, here's something I don't understand. Why is it that Shay has Templar decoration? But well, he's not officially a Templar yet. Imagine the rose, but it feels so weird that Shay doesn't feel like I don't like being part of the manuscript. The assassin's and then has been in my possession for some time. I reclaimed it when my men found you marooned. The Grand Master himself charged me to discover its meaning, a task I regret I have failed to complete. I leave it in your charge, Master Cormac. There is no one else. I it makes know. sense for his brother to be branched with Templar. Garrison surrounded by hostile natives. Decorations, but it just doesn't feel right that it was granted with Templar decoration the moment you get the Morgan back. I have no illusions that our resistance it's a very small thing, but visual storytelling is something that a lot of games should definitely embrace. Soul to the Father of Understanding. Yours, Colonel George Monroe. And this is a good time to uh, tab off now.